Good morning. This is vlog 492. <laughs> well, these are cool. It kind of looks like um, McDonald's shoes, but they're not. They're not. Do you want to see them on? Yeah, let me see them on. Soft slipper inside. Not really even a slipper, just a soft band. Really comfortable. Can you can you tap dance? Back in my days at Vaudeville. <laughs> they look good. Comfy. Just finishing these up. And then start on the final head. This is the pattern. So then I take it apart and I make it out of this firm foam. We're good to go. It is a gorgeous Friday. Uh, it's a little breezy out here in Malibu. It's still a little bit warm, but you can tell that there's definitely a change in the air. I'm headed south. I'm going into Pacific Palisade, which is a town that's right near Malibu. I have a meeting with uh, the Palisadian Post, which is the newspaper, primarily news, the primary newspaper for uh, Pacific Palisades. They want to meet with me for some reason, having to do with cars. Not really sure what it is. But among that, I have about eight other stops that I'm going to be doing today, including going Went out to visit my uh, fireball pop and a bunch of other stuff so let's get to it still driving the 2017 mitsubishi outlander gt i'm digging this car it's kind of a small suv haven't done too many unusual things with the car so far you know i haven't been to the beach or taken the dogs or lug surfboards it's a pretty straightforward car gets the job done uh, aesthetically it's nice not as necessarily as powerful as the uh, the last Hyundai Santa Fe that I had, but uh, I like the interior. So far, so good. This is John Harlow. We are at the Palisadian Post, and we're going to be doing some fun stuff with you guys. Um, you guys are already having a lot of fun, but I figured mm -hmm. I'll join in and do some things with you. We need you. We need your high octane spirit. And we're looking forward to working with you and setting the world on light. I, I think, think it's going to be a blast. We're going to do a once a month column uh, on the Palisadian Post and having to do with cars, which is it's fantastic. Every paper needs. Every Palisadian is looking forward to what you recommend, what you tell us, how, why, as Americans do drive on the wrong side of the road, but we're gonna make sure you get us back on the right side. I'm not sure I'll be able to explain that. <laughs> we did a lot of things backwards. But anyway, I'm grateful, I appreciate it, and I look forward to it, it's gonna be good. It's gonna be fun. And right. thank you, read the Palisadian Post, and keep up with Fireball. All right, well, we're gonna have some fun with the Palisadian Post. Right now, though. 
What's up, Pop? Yes. What's up? So you have a new project that you are uh, in the midst of doing. It's fabulous. It's the best thing he's ever written. It's brilliant. Brilliant. It's brilliant. <laughs> I'm listen, serious. Listen she knows what she's talking about. Cheering squad in the back. What What is it? What are you working on? Well, uh, I finished Monty, the story of Montgomery Clift, uh, as, as a one-person play. And But that's it based on a script that you wrote years ago? Yes. Yeah. So you turned it into a play? I turned it into a play. And what's happening with the play right now? It's been submitted uh, to the Geffen Theater. Uh, so they're deciding whether they want to do it? Yes. Yes. And who, who do you see playing Montgomery Clift? Uh, well, my, my uh, the person I thought about immediately when I was writing it was Eddie Redmayne because he's a very talented, gifted young actor. He would be fabulous. British actor, but yeah. he can do American, and he would be wonderful. But, you know, okay. we'll see. All right. Well, if you know who Montgomery Clift is, he was an actor back in the 50s, 40s? Yeah, uh, all those years. He yeah. really starred in A Place in the Sun with Elizabeth Taylor. Yeah. And, uh, very cool. So if uh, if you're into that kind of thing, leave a comment down in the uh, uh, down below and say, uh, "Hey, make this happen." Yeah. Go for it, Tony. Right. Say it right there. Go for it, Tony. Go for Go it. Go for it, Tony. Go for it. All right, next step down, just dropped off the old farts, and now I'm gonna head over to Whole Foods. Got some Thanksgiving stuff to get for Kathy, then a quick trip to Michael's, the craft store, and then boom, I'm out of here. It looks like Thanksgiving is gonna be happening at our house. We're gonna be inviting Sean and Isla and Sean's dad, Bob, over. All a bunch of vegetarians, except for Bob, but he'll make do. And I got four, no, five, five different vegetarian turkey versions. So we get to try them out, see which one's the best. Just had to pick up some custom letters, have a little project going on. Not a lot of car stuff today, a lot of event stuff. Basically just drove all over Los Angeles uh, doing a lot of different errands. Uh, Kathy has been working uh, pretty consistently on this, this rapper dog, you know, PlayStation costume. It's coming along, looking pretty good. I'll show you guys a little bit more progress tomorrow. Great time hanging out with my folks and uh, you know, they are looking good. Dad, of course, is going nuts on his, uh, his new play things that he's doing he's you know he's, he's writing lots of plays he plans on uh, he just finished this one with that's focused on Montgomery Clift he's also has another one that another two that are coming I can't really say what they are you know I don't want to jinx it but the thought for today uh, comes down to one word and that word is appreciation 
you know, I, I appreciate my life. I appreciate the, the things that I get to do on a daily basis. I appreciate you guys hanging out, being able to do these vlogs, being able to, to get people on them and to uh, get some stories and to be able to, to film and uh, kind of cover my day to day. It's a really great life. It's really uh, a lot of fun and it doesn't, it's, it's not like it's not challenging, but for the most part, I have a good time. But what you guys are seeing are really like the 12 to 15 best minutes throughout the day. There's a lot of other times where there's a lot of other things going on, but it's not necessarily that interesting, or maybe it's interesting and I just couldn't get the camera out in time. And as the saying goes with appreciation, when you appreciate something, it expands and it grows. You know, when you uh, when you pet your dog, your dog gives you back love. When you when you say good things to your kids and you show your appreciation for for the things that they do, then they they just want to do more. When you show appreciation for your husband or your wife, then uh, they feel good and they want to take care of you more and they want to do more things. You know, appreciation is like adding water to a plant or adding plant food. It it grows and expands. When you criticize and you put down, uh, it controls and you make people feel bad. It just, it doesn't get you where you want to be. The answer in most people's lives, and I, I feel very strongly, and the answer, the thing that, that, that everybody needs more than anything else is appreciation. And I want to, I want to say to you guys how much I appreciate you for watching, for hanging out with me, for uh, uh, seeing, you know, for us meeting up at car shows and different things and telling me the things that you like. It's very important to me to know so that I, this blog can consistently get better and grow and do, do much better is I need to get feedback from you guys. I need to know that you like these kinds of cars or you like these kinds of shows. It's my goal for this this vlog to be as inspiring as it can because, you know, I really enjoy interacting with people and talking and being inspired myself. And the more, you know, appreciation comes to me, the more I expand and want to be able to, to do a better job for you guys. And then I can give that back to you guys in a variety of ways, whether that's the vlog here or it's books or it's a variety of different things. Hopefully, by watching this vlog, your life will be just a little bit better because the more that you're grateful for the stuff that you have in your life, but the more those things grow. And if you know that, and you're aware of that, and you keep pushing that, then your life gets better. So that's it for today's vlog. Thanks for watching, uh, hanging out with me today. Uh, not that much of an exciting day, but I did manage to get a lot of things done, so that was cool. Tomorrow's a brand new day, and it, it's a better opportunity to, to, to expand and to appreciate and to, and to feel awesome about the day. The more you hang out with me, the more cool stuff we do.